Hello. Today, we will be demonstrating a brief overview of the new rank tracking tool available in Raven called SERP Tracker. This tool will give you the ability to check keyword rankings based on customizable parameters that you, the user, can set. Every Raven Tools monthly plan includes 1,200 rank position checks, with additional checks available at .003 cents a month. This pricing structure gives you the flexibility to track what you want, as often as you want, and however you want, without forcing you to upgrade to the next tier of pricing of our tools. Your rank position check usage can be viewed here. As you can see, I currently am at 143 checks of my 1,200 check limit. Something to note, 1200 is the entire account limit and not just the limit for this campaign. Your usage will add up across all campaigns and be displayed in total. Next to this, we have your date range selector, which functions the same as in any other area of Raven. On this same line, we have your tool options. For this tool, you can export data as well as check your current usage in more detail. Before showing you how to add a keyword, I wanted to note that originally we wanted to understand how often people would check their keywords. We found during beta testing that the default was not daily checks as we had imagined. In turn, we decided to break down rank tracking into its smallest component, the rank position of check of one keyword in one search engine with one type of device for one zip code or region. This gives you the ability to be extremely flexible in your keyword ranking search. So let's go through the process of adding a keyword so you can see how flexible that can ultimately be. To get started, click Add Keywords. Here, you're going to choose your keyword or keyword phrases. Then you can select your frequency at which you would like the keyword to be searched, as well as the search engines to be included in the results. Currently, we allow for a frequency set of daily, weekly, or monthly. Something to note here is that the check will be made immediately for all frequency types, and the next search will happen on your selected frequency. For example, if today is the 10th, and I select monthly frequency that is set to run on the first of every month, I will get an immediate result that happened on today, the 10th, and then the next month on the first, the search will run again according to my settings. Next, I will add my search engine parameters. For this example, I'm going to include Google and Bing. Something to note here, we have added the ability to check the same keyword from as many zip codes as you like, or you can see the same SERP for mobile versus desktop. This was included to enhance the flexibility of your search. For this example, I'm going to add two zip codes and one mobile search. In review, I have added my keyword, selected a frequency, and included search engine parameters. Something to note, because I have added one, two, three, and four search engine parameters, this would count as four rank position checks and would be added to my rank position check usage total. Once I have decided, this is what I want to run, I can click on Review and Confirm. Here, a pop-up confirmation box will appear. This will summarize your selection and ask if you would like to run the search. As you can see, my summary reads, Add one keyword to be tracked monthly on four search engines. This will generate four or more additional rank position checks each month. Ranking data is populated within 24 hours. Within 24 hours, you will be provided with the at-a-glance metrics you need for your keywords. Something to note here, you can toggle your view based on latest position, average position, as well as view only the ranking keywords or all keywords. When looking at all keywords, you can see the entries that did not have a ranking have an NA designation. Also, if you look at the top of your screen, you will have a summary of all keywords data and how it compares to the previous date range. The last section of SERP tracker is your competitor ranking. To view this, you can click on competitors. Within this section, you can either add a competitor that already exists or you can create a new one. 
When creating a new competitor in this section, it will be added as a competitor throughout your campaign. Once a competitor is selected, their keyword rankings will be displayed next to yours, and this will allow for a side-by-side -side comparison. This section also allows you to compare this per search engine, and you can select that by using the drop-down on the right hand of the screen. One thing to note, is that once a competitor is added, you will either need to run your search again or wait to the next scheduled search runs to get that competitor data into the system.